On today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to add these cool little clickable links over here that you're seeing um, to your Facebook profile. This is a question that I have been asked and therefore I am delivering. So if you want to know how to do it, Stay tuned. What's up, I'm Sherry Brown, and on this channel, I do everything from different product reviews, tutorials, just like you're seeing now, as well as actual marketing and social media strategies that busy work at home moms can use and implement to take them further faster when building their online business. So if you're new here and this seems to be up your alley, consider subscribing. Just make sure that you hit the bell so you get notified as I upload new videos each and every week. So let's go ahead and hop into the tutorial. So I'm gonna show you two different ways to do this. Now, the first is just on your mobile device and I'm using an iPhone. And then I'm also gonna hop over and show you how to do it from your desktop as well. So I'm gonna give you two different versions um, or two different ways that you can do this. So right now I'm just on my mobile phone. As you can see, I'm kind of scrolling through. And so all you wanna do to add these little clickable links, like the first one that takes people to my Instagram account, which to be honest with you, I'm gonna be removing. <laughs> I'm only adding it just to kind of show you how to do it. Um, I'm not really too active on Instagram. Uh, this second one obviously takes them directly over to my YouTube channel. So I love adding the links because it's a way that you can easily drive traffic wherever you're wanting to take somebody. Um, and so all you do is right under where you see these different, um, these different links, you're going to see where this says about. So if you just click on the about right here, this is going to take you to where you can just scroll down and under the contact information, you're gonna click on this little button that says edit over here in the upper right hand corner. So when you click edit, you're gonna scroll down and you're gonna see this little section right here where it says social links. And so I'm just gonna click the little X to remove Instagram. Um, so I'm just gonna click that. So to add a social link, you're just going to click add social link you can use this little drop down right here and scroll and kind of pick out with like which social link you're wanting to add. So I'm just going to click on Instagram. And then what you're going to type here under account name is your username. And so my username on Instagram, Sherry underscore Brown underscore coaching. And then once you're done, you're just going to click done or go, either one, done or go. And um, then all you do is you just go back. I'm just gonna click back to my profile, this little button right here. And I'm gonna refresh, scroll down. And as you can see, Instagram is right here. So if I click the link, again, that's gonna take people directly to my Instagram account. Now, also I wanna show you, you can add other different, um, other different like website links aside from social. So you just go right back there, click edit. And if you wanted to add any um, other websites, you can do that right here. So my websites that I'm driving traffic to, the first one is just an opt-in page to get inside of my free group. I have a free group on Facebook, a free community called Back to the Basics Community. And then I have my actual website, Sherry Brown Coaching. And then this um, third website is where I house my courses. And so you would just add your social links there. So again, if I wanted to click on, you know, Back to the Basics Academy, click here. Um, and then you just scroll up and those are the different uh, courses that I have. Uh, you can drive traffic wherever it is that you wanna take them. So now what I'm gonna do is I am going to pull up and I am gonna show you how to do this from your desktop. Um, right here, I'm still on my profile. So all you have to do is scroll down. And in this little section right here, if you hover over it, in the upper right hand corner, there's this blue little pencil that's gonna pop up. You just click edit. And you're just gonna scroll down and this is where you would do the same thing. So you have to hover again to get the little edit to pop up. You would just click edit. And again, this is where you would add whatever social sites uh, that you want. There's the drop down menu. Once you're done adding your username, you would just click save changes and then it will actually show up on your, uh, on your profile. And that is it. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy, right? So hope you got some value from today's quick little tutorial on how to add social links and website links to your Facebook profile. 
At the end of this video, you're gonna see another little playlist pop up, and that playlist is just links to other little tutorials that you may wanna check out. And question of the day, what social links are you going to be adding to your Facebook profile? Put those in the comments below, and if there is a tutorial that you'd like for me to do that you don't already see, then uh, let me know in the comments below, and I'll be happy to, uh, to put one up for you. Until next time, bye for now.